photograph. There's a little part right here that like introduces how to clean and stuff. Well, not how to clean. We already know how to clean. Oh, hello, Fuzzy. What perfect timing you have. We just finished readying everyone's favorite fossil cleaning partner. Say hello to KL33N. I eat you. It's just annoying, like, what he says. It's annoying and distracting when you're actually, um, cleaning. He is a useful, like, cleaning slave guy. My favorite one, actually, is KL34N. For anyone that hasn't memorized that, he's the guy that, like, the yellow version that when you're walking, um, like, when you're doing your level up cleaning things, he'll be there and be like, oh yeah, clean this fossil to so-and-so points. He doesn't talk very much. Pleased to meet you, Beep. I am KL33N at your service, Boop. Please speak to me if you wish to clean your fossil rocks, Beep. You, tr you may trust me with the storage and reviving of even your most pre precious fossils. I'm not yet capable of cleaning on my own, but if I observe you doing so, I can gain that ability as well. Once I absorb enough of your knowledge, I'll be able to clean fossil rocks on my own, Zit. I'm looking forward to working with you. Bwang. This little guy will be a great help on your adventure. The more you clean, the more he'll learn from you, and believe me, he can learn a lot. Oh, and at that counter, you can exchange donation points for all kinds of rewards. I should probably explain donation points, shouldn't I? <laughs> Again, I'm not gonna go through like that stuff. Oh yeah, the VMM. This is a Vivisaur Magnum Machine, or VMM for short. Basically, it stores dino metals for fighters. If you revive a new Vivisaur, you must use the VMM to place it on a team before you can use it in battle. Here, let me show you how VMM works. I feel bad because I'm skipping all these things, but I don't really care. Well, I'm just gonna skip through this. this is, the screen's probably blurry right now, but I don't really care. Did you get all that? Um, sure. Yeah, I was paying attention. Ha, huh, good answer. You sure didn't... Your mom didn't raise any dummies. Okay. Oh, and when you're at the dig site, you may see an orange-colored VMM. They have a warp system built in. The warp will transport you back to town instantly. It's actually pretty handy, if I do say so myself. Okay, you should get back to digging and the cleaning... Okay, you should get back to the digging and the cleaning so you're ready for the round one match. If you're having trouble digging, you might consider upgrading your sonar at the shop. I recommend a bigger screen as your first purchase. It will let you see fossil rocks over a much wider area. Anyway, there's a shop in the fossil guide if you want to swing by and see what they have. Okay, um, I don't think that I actually have to clean them. I'm just gonna go and check. I seriously don't want to clean on screen. Cause that is just so boring to watch. I mean, seriously. Oh, and if you read my bulletin, I'm not going to read any of my messages at all. Cause everyone is telling me what's happening. I don't want to know who Zonga Zonga is. Seriously. Oh, he's so dreaming, dreamy. All the mysterious and smoldering and stuff. Well, crud, I didn't expect to see him in the cup. This is going to make it harder to win, that's for sure. Huh? Hey Fuzzy, did you hear? Rupert has entered in the cup. That's right, THE Rupert! Exclamation point. They're about to start a TV interview with Rupert now. Good morning, I'm Linda R. Porter. Ha ha ha, hilarious puns, fossil fighters maker of people reporting for Calisteo TV with the Calisteo why is your name still three question marks with the Calisteo cup underway we have an exclusive interview with one of the fighters this undefeated child prodigy is on a stunning run of victories across multiple fossil fighting tournaments of course they'll be saying that about me in a couple of like um battles he's also the hair heir I pronounce it hair deal to a Multinational corporation- Multinational? D don't people say international? I'm not the only one that says stuff wrong, lady. Multinational corporation that produces a wide range of goods for fighters. 
It's the Prince of Fossil Dig Incorporated and the talk of every fighter in town. Ladies and gentlemen, say hello to Rupert. No last name available. Rupert, let's get right to it. Do you feel confident about winning the cup? No. Oh yes, quite. There's little- I've been giving him a British accent. Deal. There's little point in entering competition if one does not expect to win. Spoken like a true champion, there is little doubt that this young competitor has sipped off from the cup of victory. Were any other fighters to say as much, we might accuse them of hubris. But for Rupert, it is fact. Will this title come to him as have all the others, or will the new hero or more, or will a new hero? Ugh, screw it, I'm not gonna say it. One thing is clear: all eyes will be on the Calisteo Cup. Oh, and we've been asked by the organizers to pass the message along to our viewers. Despite his fame, at the end of the day, Rupert is still a competitor entered in the cup. Though you may be smitten by his roughish charm, please do not mob him or try to steal locks of his hair. Any entrance found to be annoying Rupert in such a manner may be subject to disqualification. And that's all the time we've got for Calisteo TV. This is Linda R. Porter saying good day and good fortune. Idiocy. Ooh, I'd like to chase off after Rupert and see if he's really all that. I'm really all that. Hey, yeah, they said not to annoy him, but they didn't say we couldn't challenge him to a battle. Sweet, I'm going for it. Wish me luck. Terrible luck come your way, Todd. Ha 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 ha. I was thinking of something before. Don't eat my bubbles. Choke on and die on my bubbles. Waha. Haha. Hey, Rupert, what's up? Hey, what do you say you and me have a good old-fashioned fossil battle? You know that excited feeling you get when you meet a tough fighter? Well, I have it. You like fossil battles, and you know that feeling, so let's have some fun. Please go and amuse yourself, else I'm really bad at holding accents. I apologize, this sucks. I don't have time to waste on the likes of you. Let's have fun, excited feeling, such disgusting... Trachel is enough to make my porridge come up. See, he's British. Frankly, I abhor having to associate with fighters such as yourself. If you wish to face me in a fossil battle, you must win to my standing in the tournament. Of course, there's no chance of that happening. Now run along and take your sad vivisaurs with you. But what? How dare you? You don't have any idea how talented I am. As talented as a rolled up newspaper. I totally stole that line from Sniffles. I think you're just chicken. Bok, bok, bok. So you demand satisfaction, do you? Very well. If it will keep you from stalking me in the future. Oh no, dude. I'm going to go on your Facebook and I'm going to look up your every post. Wahaha! Ha ha ha! Once I show you what a true fossil battle is like, you can run home and tell mommy all about it. Okay. Now, this is really weird because you just get to watch a fossil battle. <laughs> this is hilarious. Suck. <laughs> of course, it acts like you lost, but you didn't do anything. If you're hearing the TV in the background, I'm sorry. I lost. I lost a lot. Truly pathetic. Are you even paying attention to the elemental type of your Vivisaur? Yeah, but I had to put it in the AZ. I only have one Vivisaur, duh. 
That's what I would have said. Elemental type? Oh, this is indeed sad. Think that a fighter who knows nothing about elemental types. Oh, very well. Pay attention. Okay, no, I'm going to screw you. <laughs> yeah. Oh, come now, what is this nonsense? But I Must I truly battle every slack-jawed yokel who slinks into view? Yep. Sorry, dude. Enough! I'll not spend one more second on this madness. I say good day, sir. Obviously British. Hark! I've lost plenty of time, but I've never been this- I've still a little bit of British accent, but I've never been this angry about it. That's it, Fuzzy. We have to win our way through the cup together. We have to take down that Rupert jerk, no matter what. Yeah. Beep, 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 beep. Incoming FMS message. Round one of the Calisteo Cup will now begin. Today, Todd's opponent will be fuzzy. Prepare yourselves before checking in at the regular town fo fossil stadium. By fossil stadium, they mean uh, fighter station. Just go in there and it'll have fossil stadium music. It's really cool, actually. Wow. So you're my round one opponent? Boom, man. I was hoping to face you in the final. Stupid computer. Well, there's nothing we can do about it, Fuzzy. We'll have to fight as hard as we can. Until our round one match is done, I'm gonna think of you as an enemy. I'm gonna fossil battle you hard. I mean, crazy hard. Okay, that's it. This has actually gone on really long, so I'm just gonna end the part right now.